How does it work if you have ever received a one-time code on your Android device? Where do you put it? Let's get started. So whenever you do something, you might be required to confirm your identity. So you can either a verification, get a verification code by email or a phone number, right? So you, you can use that to, uh, these are used and entered into the verification field of the app or website, which is requesting it, right? So it might be happening that you are confirming the identity when logging into Snapchat, for example. So you might get a, a text message inside of the messages app with the one-time code so you can remember it or copy it, but then you will return back to the app where it was requested from you. So let's say it was Snapchat and you will type that in a back into the field where you are supposed to. So it is pretty simple. You just have to pay attention to what exactly you are supposed to confirm and then just head back to the app after you receive the code so you can put it back into the place where it belongs. Many apps nowadays automatically detect the code. If you, for example, you know, just receive it as a notification, a lot of times you'll see it like somewhere inside of the app or in the keyboard that you can easily just click on it once and the verification code will be filled out automatically. So that's very useful. And that's basically how it kind of works. So as I said, you need to check your either email or text messages because it is most likely there and then return back to the place where it was requested and either copy or remember it and just type that in. So that's how it works. If you have more questions or thoughts, go ahead and leave them below in the comments. Thanks a lot for watching and your support and I'll see you in the next video.